Hello dear programmers, how are you doing today? Welcome to Codespay and topic of this video is how to add, update and delete Firebase data which are collections and documents from our Flutter application. The code which I am gonna write in this particular video is valid for both iOS and Android applications. Before you go ahead and continue on to this particular video, I will highly recommend to go ahead and look into my earlier videos where I have explained how to connect Firebase for iOS as well as for Android application. I am recommending that because the code which I am going to write in this particular video is an extension to the code written in that particular video. So let's go ahead with our code. So this is what I did in my last video where I have a database. Let me show you the Firebase database. It has a collection called Superheroes and this collection has lots of documents which contains the name of superheroes like a spider-man superman etc now let's talk about my code what i did in my body is that i created a new stream builder which takes a stream which a stream comes from fire store instance and the collection which is superheroes and i'm iterating through the collection snapshots which gives me each and every document I iterate through the document length and display all the document in my body. So you can see that if I change this Batman to something like Batman 2 or something, things will be reflected over here like Batman 2. And if I add a new document, let's say new superhero, uh, let's say Terminator and then Terminator will be reflected over here. You can see Terminator came here. Now that was the very basic application. Let's move forward. What if I want to add document in my Flutter code so that it's updated into my Firebase document. So to do that, let's start writing some code. So I'll write the code in this floating action button. As of now, it's doing nothing because I have removed all the code from this on test. Okay. So let me go ahead and show you how we can add some data. So to add some data, first of all, you create the Firestore instance and go to your collection. So collection is superheroes. Okay. And go to document. Okay. Now in this particular document, I can call a function called set data. Okay. Set data takes a hash map and I can directly give it over here as a JSON and where I can say name as our new hero uh, new hero is coming for example okay so what i'm trying to do is that as soon as someone presses this particular button it will go to the collection called superheroes and add a new document the field of which will be name and the value will be a new hero is coming let me go ahead and do a hot reload it's done and let me press the plus button you can see that a new hero is coming over here it not only came over here but it also here in my firebase document so see a new hero is coming if i press the plus button two three times every time a new hero is coming is being added over here also and over here also that's the way you can add documents from your flutter application to the firebase database okay let's now see how to update the data in a particular document let's assume that i want to update my name field over here how will i do that in this particular case this document id comes into picture so let me go ahead and copy this document id i'll go back to my code in the same line of code what i will do i'll provide the document id in the document and instead of set data i'll say update data Okay, and here I can change the text to, let's say, hero is coming. Okay, that's the only change that is required to update the data. Let's go ahead and do a hot reload. Okay, and let me enable this particular page as well as, uh, let me press the plus button over here. You can see that hero is coming is being changed over here as well as over here. If I change something over here, like uh, let's say new hero 
and update it new hero will come over here and if i press the plus button at again hero is coming will be replaced over here so that's the way you update the data now let's talk about deleting the data deleting is also very easy you go back to this particular code get the document id and just call dot delete that's all so let me go ahead and do a hot reload and i'll just open the firebase page and this is the thing which i want to delete and if i press the plus button you can see it's been deleted from the database as well as from my app so now you can see that how with very small amount of code we can add update and delete my documents that are there in my firebase database so that's all for this particular video guys i hope i was able to explain few key concepts in a easiest possible way we will see more use cases in further videos thanks a lot guys thanks for watching please take a moment to like subscribe and share thank you thanks a lot